How do we purge CO2 from the air in a closed container without the process of photosynthesis? Okay. Here is a closed room with a guy. And surrounding him are oxygen molecules and some CO2 molecules. As he breathes and moves around he exhales more CO2 molecules into the room. As this guy keeps on breathing, the number of CO2 molecules keeps on increasing and cannot escape. This guy will eventually be short of breath due to the high amount of CO2 in the air. Breathing in too much carbon dioxide will result in a condition known as hypercapnia respiratory failure. The body will hyperventilate and this guy will feel dizzy and panicky. Eventually, passing out and getting brain death. So how can we fix this problem and get rid of these harmful CO2 molecules in the air? There was a genius scientist who worked to help the Apollo astronauts to breathe in a space shuttle and finally he had figured out the problem by using a chemical reaction. He tried many substances to react with CO2 and eventually found the most fitted substance. Although this substance was expensive, astronauts still used it. The substance the scientist used was called lithium hydroxide. He experimented by combining this substance with carbon dioxide gas and this reaction produced a solid called lithium carbonate in tiny amounts of water. In a spaceship, lithium hydroxide is stored in a canister because this substance is highly corrosive. So beware. The canister acts like a filter machine by absorbing CO2 from the air and creates a chemical reaction inside the canister. Why use anhydrous lithium hydroxide? Well first it has high absorption rate for CO2, second anhydrous means crystalline producing no water and last but not least, it produces small amount of heat to not affect the space shuttle. What kind of reaction is this? It is both an exothermic reaction like a burning flame and a single displacement reaction. Here is a picture of some astronauts replacing the old canisters for new canisters. The old canisters are now filled with lithium carbonate instead of lithium hydroxide. Now with the lithium hydroxide canisters installed in the closed room, this guy can finally breathe freely. Here are my sources. Thanks for watching. Created using Powtoon.